it with your hands. You got that? Don't, don't go too far back on the top of it. If you touch in the floor, you have to immediately stop and you're allowed to just sort of pull him up with one hand and then carry on. Okay, but you must stop. You can't keep moving. When you get to the end, when you get to the gentleman here, gentlemen, you have to mount her, uh, uh, mount the dolphin. I mean, hang on, you mount the dolphin while she's still on it. Okay? 
and then you can get off, okay? But you can't get off until he's got on. You're then allowed one touch, that's it. The dolphin, right? You're allowed to pull the dolphin up once. You then have to finish the race by getting to the other end of the dance floor, okay? Have you got it? You're not allowed to touch it with your hands, remember? Okay, have you got it? Just let's have a practice go and see if this works out. It might be fine, it might be a bloody nightmare, we'll see. So, uh... Four. Again, no, give, give the ladies the dolphin. Oh, no, no, we won't. We'll start with the gentleman. No, we'll do it that way. Right now, you've got to turn round, okay? To do it. And if, and, excuse me, Norma, you were rubbish. You were the worst I've ever seen. And you weren't any, you weren't much help either. Right, you can cheer on your respective teams. We're going to go for it this time. Hopefully, it'll be the real thing. Gentlemen. Mount your dolphins. Wait for it. Four. Wait for it. Three. Two. One. Go! Oh no, it's the floor. And the normal's on back to front. She's done it again. What the hell is she doing? He touched the floor. And he... No, 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 no. Yeah, you'll have to excuse the suit. Obviously, John Travolta was a bit bloody taller than I am, but still, never mind. Um, so, uh, a little bit dancing, but I'll tell you what, not just dancing, let, let's make this a little bit sort of different, a bit of fun. Um, and I could do with um, six volunteers for this. Um, now, I don't mind whether you're rich or poor people, or normal people. So, I just need a mixture. Say three ladies, three men. Yeah, you'll do. It's a full-size sausage with half a side of bacon on it. For normal people, they've just got a normal piggy blanket. The poor people, because they're so poor, their pigs haven't got any blankets. All they've got is a tiny little wiener that's naked as the day it was born. <laughs> because we are going to be playing the Christmas pudding game. Hooray! Now, some of you, this is a little bit like Willy Wonka and the chocolate factory thing. Because um, normally with Christmas pudding, what happens is, if you're lucky, you find something a little extra in your pudding, don't you? Now, because of health and safety and all that rubbish, Apparently, we're not allowed to stick anything in your food anymore in case you choke on it. Ah. Oh. But there are some special golden tickets. You've got them already on your Christmas pudding. If you haven't finished eating, don't tip it upside down, but look under your plates. Christmas pudding, look under your plates. There are some very special golden tickets. Who's got one? I can't get down. Oh, and we got a winner over here! Christmas pudding winner! I'm so excited. Who is it? Is it you? Yes, the golden 
Hallelujah. Yeah, we pray down. Come with me. We've got a winner. Hooray! Yeah, don't stand over there. Hang on. Who else? When it falls down, you have to instantly stop and pick it back up and then you carry on. You're not, you've got to keep your arms in the air. Ready? Oh, no, I'm on the wrong bloody number now. It's gone up to number seven. Uh, ready and go! Bear your arms up. Yeah, you're both turning the same way. You've got to turn. Because it didn't, because we're going to do it again, and this time I'm going to watch a bit closer. Right, go back. This is the final. Don't mind the. Yeah, that's twice you've been in the final. Right, so. Go this way. To do it correctly, it's completely impossible to do it the speed you just did it, just to give you an idea. Yeah. Right, come on, concentrate this time. This is it. The last time. Ready? And go! There you are, love you. And then back again. Come on, back. Come on, back. We're carrying on the back. You're going so well. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're, we're going to confuse it slightly. Uh, can I do this? Yes, I can. We're going to declare both of them the winners. Now, normally, normally, now, what can we possibly give as a special prize for our Christmas pudding? Yeah. So, what we thought was Christmas pudding. But, but. No, it's not funny. I went to the shop, and you know, there's none on the shelves at all in February. You can't buy Christmas pudding. So instead, what they had... Oh, I can't bend down. They didn't have any... Um, I got one of each. They didn't have any Christmas puddings, but what they did have on the shelf was Easter eggs! <laughs> now, what I'm going to have to do, you two are going to have to fight over this, because... I've only got, I can't get it out of my sack. I've only got two Easter eggs and two bottles of Nelly Champagne. So, who wants Nelly Champagne? And the couple. Range. Can you take that one before it goes? Just that one. What would you like? You'll have that. And you'll have the Easter egg. There we go. And then over here, then, which one would you like the Nelly for you? And the Easter egg for you. Give a round of applause, our double winners tonight. Wonderful. Lovely. Your first number is six and two, sixty-two. Has anybody got that one? Yeah. Well, you're off to a bloody good start then, aren't you? Your next number is four and six, forty-six. Hang on a minute, there's an hang on here. What's the matter? Come on. So what's happened? Well, with a million, why have you got any bingo tickets? Uh, I've got a whole table here with no tickets. Come on, quick. You have to be quick, though. I'm going to get your money, buddy. It's a five.